Today we're going to learn how to create comments inside of HTML and CSS. And the reason we want to do this is because sometimes if you were to create a lot of code inside your website, it can be kind of tough to know what is what inside your code if you do not create small comments for yourself so you can actually see what the specific code does. So let's actually go ahead and take a look at our front page here, which is our HTML file. And inside the body tags, you guys can see that I have an H2 tag and I have a paragraph tag. Now what I can do here if I want to create a comment inside HTML is that I can go ahead and go on top of my H2 tag and I can say lesser than exclamation mark dash dash. And now you guys can see everything after the comment tag here turned gray. And that's because right now, all of this down here after the comment tag is a comment. So what I can do is I can actually go ahead and say we want to create a comment that says this is the main content. And then I can close off the comment tag by saying dash dash greater than. So right now, as you guys can see, we just closed off the comment tag. And right now, the only comment is going to be the text in between the tags. So now we talked about how to create a comment inside HTML, but what about inside CSS? So if we were to go inside my style sheet, which is up here, you guys can see that I have a bunch of code inside the file here, which is because in the previous episode, we talked about something called a reset style sheet. So a bunch of this code here is actually not my code. It's actually some code that we need to have before we start up a website. So I want to tell by commenting where my code starts inside this file here. So at the top here, we do actually have the reset styling. So we'll just scroll down to where my code starts, which is right about here. Then I can go afterwards here and say that I want to create a comment by saying forward slash and then the star symbol or the multiplication symbol. And then I can go ahead and say my code just to kind of illustrate this is my code. Then I can say star symbol forward slash. And now we ended off the comment as well. So this is basically what I wanted to show you guys when it comes to commenting inside HTML and CSS, which is in fact really important to do when you create big projects, because if you don't create comments, you can't follow which code does what inside the website. So it's really important that you note down what code does what. So this is basically what I wanted to show you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time.